is up, my boners? This is Mr. I Try Hard here, the nasty S commentator in all of motherfucking YouTube. How you guys been doing? I've been doing motherfucking fantastic, and today we have a gameplay kill confirmed on Village for you guys. Now, I know this is the second Village gameplay in two days, but I had to upload this right away because you guys have been complaining about, you know, me using all the Try Hard guns all the time, you know, the Type 95, the ACR, the MP7, and you guys have been complaining about that, even though my name is Mr. I Try Hard, but... I understand that, and I completely understand that you guys want variety in your gameplays, therefore, I decided to take the fucking stupidest SMG in the game, and when you run like this with your fist in one hand and your gun in the other, you know it's a bad gun, right? And I decided to use the MP9 Silence. Hope you guys enjoy this gameplay. This is the first gameplay I got with it, and it's pretty decent. Hope you guys are, 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 are happy with this, and I'll try to bring more variety to that. that. That's my bad. I don't play enough Call of Duty, and I should, but anyways, that that's the whole deal. Now, yesterday's video... Got a lot of great feedback. You guys have been loving that shit. You guys have been clicking that jizz on my pants bun. So the fucking much. Please never stop doing that. But um, it wasn't really an awkward question. It was more of a serious commentary, serious topic, how to lose your virginity. It's linked down below as a channel response. Go check that out. It's it's a great video. And uh, you guys liked it, and you guys left a lot of great feedback on it. Some like real life situations. A lot of you guys felt like if it like reached you and stuff like that. And that was great. So I'm gonna dip a little bit more into that. And I got a comment from yesterday's video, which got a lot of thumbs up. So I feel like you guys are in the, the same situation as this young man right here and uh, this guy by the way is uh, named Bernie X and he says I'm 15 and a freshman in high school and I still haven't kissed a girl I'm not a bad looking guy from what I can hear but I have no confidence and I'm shy as fuck around the ladies and don't know what to do now I'm pretty sure the majority of you guys out there feel the same way about ladies and I can totally understand that you know when I was 15 years old I was shy as shit you know I wasn't a bad looking guy I was a, I was a good looking dude it was fine I was fit I was playing sports all the time and I was good look like I, I never had problems but um, I was still shy, you know, I was never one to make the first move, and there was always these dudes, these jocks, you know, they were always, they always had that suave going on, man, they were always getting all the ladies, and they were all, you know, fucking good looking shit, and I hated those dudes, man, but I realize now that there was one thing I had, uh, they had that I did not, and that was confidence, right? They had the guts, they had, like, they weren't, like, that much better looking than I was, and, like, they certainly weren't, you know, nicer than I was. I was perfectly, like, I was a perfectly fine bro, but at that age, man, women are just, you know... Looking to experiment, right? Like, you know, they're not looking for the marriage. You know, they're, they're not looking for the love of their life. They're, they're just looking to have fun, just like you guys are. So, I'm, I'm, I'm the best pro fucking tip I can give to you guys when dealing with women in high school is just to have confidence and just to try it. Now, I'm sure you guys are scared of rejection, right? That's a big deal. That was a big deal for me, you know? Going out, like, going balls deep and, like, asking the lady out. Like, asking this chick out. This chick you've been, you know, going to class with every day. This chick you've been seeing all the time. And, you know, you're asking her out and she says no. You know, that could be... A crushing blow to a lot of people and I can totally understand that but there's one thing you guys have to understand nobody bats a hundred when dealing with relationships everybody's been rejected it's always it's gonna happen it's gonna happen to you guys it happened to me it's gonna happen to everyone and you just gotta learn to move on and you just gotta learn that it doesn't matter plus plus if you go in there with absolutely no confidence and in fear of, of, of rejection it's not gonna happen what ladies are looking for is of course they're looking for a nice guy who will treat her well but they're also looking for somebody confident a guy who who generates um, you know, who looks sure of himself, who, who is confident in what he says, and, and you know, if you go up to chicken like, hey, what's up, man? My name is Matthew, and you know, I'm, I'm awesome. Like, you know, you're, you're not gonna say it like that, but you're gonna portray the fact that, that you are awesome. And, and that is so much more important than having the right haircut, or wearing the nice pair of shoes, or having like, you know, a piece of jewelry on, or having money. It, confidence is everything. If you're confident, and oh, and by the way, here's another pro tip. Don't give a shit. I know this goes against everything, right? You might like this chick. You might think she's awesome. You might think she's like the most beautiful chick in the world. She's your princess. You want to date her so bad. You want to treat her so right. But giving a lady too much attention is like giving her all the power in the world, which they already have with their vagina, right? Later on in life, you will learn that the ladies control the, 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 the entire fucking world with their vagina. It's like vagina and money. That's the only thing that rules the world, right? So, you know, you don't want to give them that power, man. You want to not give a shit. You know, you can go up to them and be like, hey, what's up? My name is Matthew, and you know what? I like you. But then, then, you know, drop it. 
you know, if they feel the same way, if they want to hang out, if they want to do stuff, you can't be all puppy fucking love and always want to hold their hand and always want to be snuggly buddies and always want to fucking kiss them. You know, if, if you are in that relationship and all that stuff, give them, give them some slack. Give them some sleeway. Be that independent motherfucker. Independency is like the most attractive thing in the world. The most attractive people I've met were people that did not give a shit. And like they made you feel like if you had to work for it. And, and for some reason, ladies like that shit. Shit, man, and girl, um, guys too, by the way. In independent ladies are so attractive, but yeah, man, it, it, it works. So, so I guess the pro tips I can give you guys: don't be scared. You're not gonna bat a hundred in this thing. Everybody fucking fails at this. I've failed. You will fail. Nobody's perfect. It just happens, and you move on, man. It's not gonna be the end of the world. You know what? If that chick doesn't want you, some some other chick will, and then some other chick will be as as, as hot or as cute or as sexy and will have a nicer ass than the other chick that said no before. It's just the way it works, man. You 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 can't. Can't be fucking scared, and of course, don't give a shit. You know, not in those words, but I'm telling you, man, just don't give a shit, and it works, man. Hope you guys enjoyed, and if you want me to give you guys some more serious topics, please, please, put your situations down below in the comment section, and of course, if you got want some more stuff like this, please hit the jizz in my motherfucking pants, man, because you guys know I always enjoy that, and this has been Mr. I Try Hard. Hope you guys enjoyed. Bye. Bye-bye. Goodbye. You be shy to talk to them vaginas. Best thing try hard could give you is just don't give a shit. Cause if you don't give a shit, the dicks will wanna suck your dick, 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 dick. <laughs> I love this singing, man. Somebody should make me a fucking um, ringtone or like a montage of all my singing stuff. I think I, I think I would really enjoy that. Hope you guys enjoyed such hard. Bye, bye, and bye.